With the holidays approaching, I thought it'd be fun to make a miniature elf on the shelf. Using a red and white pipe cleaner, felt, embroidery floss, a needle and thread, wooden beads, and paint. I start by bending a pipe cleaner, trim off the excess, begin twisting it at the top for the head, body, and legs. Cut a piece of a white pipe cleaner, then twist it around for the arms, leaving enough space at the top to place the bead later. Trim the fluff from the arms and legs. Using embroidery floss or thread, begin to tightly wrap the arms. When I get to the end, I bend the pipe cleaner, go back and wrap it a few times, then continue back down the arm. Continue on the other arm, go around the neck, tie it in the front, and trim off the excess. Repeat on the legs using red, cut small rectangles of felt, wrap it around the legs and arms, and I use a needle and thread to sew the ends together on the back, covering the leg and felt. Repeat for the other leg, and to minimize the bulk, I try to keep the rectangle of felt as thin as possible. Then continue on the arms, leaving a little white on the ends for the gloves. For the body, I cut a small rectangle, make small cuts on the sides to go around the arms, then sew the ends together to close it in the back. Tie a knot the string and trim off the excess. On a thin rectangle of white felt, cut a zigzag pattern, wrap it around the neck, and sew in the back. I take a wooden bead and paint it a skin tone, lightly sketch the face and hair with a pencil, go over it with paint. I watered down a little pink to go around the eyes, then I began to fill the eyes in with white, add the eye color. I painted one with blue eyes and one with brown. Add black for the pupil, then eyelashes, then a tiny white dot for a little shine. Add some lips, paint on the hair, add a clear drying glue over the eyes to make them glossy, cut a pie shape out of the felt with the rounded end on the bottom, fold it in half, sew up the side to make a cone. Turn it inside out, glue it onto the bead, cut a thin strip of white and glue it around the edge. To make sure the hat fits snug, I am holding the white felt firmly in the back until it dries. Attach the head to the body to make a poseable, doll-sized elf on the shelf. And you're done. Happy crafting! Sitting close to keep us warm The mistletoe is hanging at the door Christmas is the time to set your mind and spirit free Everybody smile while we decorate the tree If I could, I wish for you to spend Christmas here with me to give a shout out to M Loves Donuts. What's up? Where is my copy of Perry Hopper? And who has been in my makeup? Wait a minute. What's this? Oh no. This can mean only one thing. They're back. They're watching me. Now I have to be on my best behavior. <sighs> I better go get that empty carton of milk out of the fridge.